Hello friends, in this lecture we will see next operation and that is 2D profile wall without floor. So we can create toolpath with reference to wall if we don't have any floor. So in this example we have only walls and floor is not available here but we can define floor for defining the depth. Okay, so here we have this kind of profile over the wall. So let's start. First, I'm going to define a tool. So my tool is from the library, and this time I'm using a solid tool. And solid tool of twelve. See, this is my tool. Okay. Cancel next my MCS. So MCS is it is here. Okay, center of the part. Okay, and this clearance is five point zero. Okay. Now I am going to define this workpiece. So this is my part. Select it and blank as bounding block. Okay. If you want to expand it in other direction like this here, I want to expand it. So we need to define from here. Okay. So just drag this. This will move here. Okay. Reset. It will come and my direction is this y so i'm going to change it uh, one or two m mm extra so 140 see on the both side it will automatically adjust okay the blank is defined okay tool is defined now i'm going to select this and see here, here we have this display MCS. So it will on off your MCS display. And this one for display WCS, WCS on off, this one, okay. And see, hide and show. So whatever the hidden, it will show you. And click here. Now my next option is this 2D profile wall without floor. And the tool is this workpiece. And I want to do the finishing operation. And first select the wall. So click here, tangent face, and click this. All the faces are selected. Add again this side. And okay. So walls are defined now you want to keep some material on the wall select this otherwise no need and z depth i will show you what is the z depth and stock no need to define this stock blank blank is the thickness so it is let's say this thickness first okay so what is the thickness and thickness means how much material you want to cut from the part so this is the line Okay, 35 is the length and thickness. Suppose I'm taking as 10 and generate. See, it is generating only one step and depth of cut. I'm going to define as one and generate. see it is creating the tool path and the depth of cut is one okay and 
change background to dark and this is the thickness how much thickness you are considering at your part so i am selecting this as a blank geometry so blank geometry will cut okay and if you have already done some work some operation so that time we will use this 3d ibw and for thickness we will see in another example and a step over here it is no step over so depth of cut is one and additional passes and okay first we will see this depth offset depth offset uh, is 10 now generate see it is not properly visible in this example okay z depth this z depth offset will offset the tool path whole tool path okay and uh, my profile is not like that so it is not showing you this option properly so i am selecting as zero and increase this as five and uh, I am going to generate it again. See. Here I have changed this depth of cut as 5. Now I am going to change the, this thickness mode and the wall blank thickness. It means how much material we have on this wall. So I am considering this as a 30. So it will consider as a 30 mm material on the wall and then it will generate this tool path. Okay. Now I want to create this tool path number of passes. So here additional passes. I want one more additional passes here. So it will generate one more passes here, one more pass here. See now we have two passes on this wall and two passes on this wall and the depth of cut is same 5 as we have defined here and this z depth offset i'm going to select this as negative 10 okay now generate let's see <coughs> see it is offset from the wall uh, from the bottom of this part 10 mm offset so it is 10 mm away from the bottom of this part if you want up to the floor just generate okay just see the preview Okay, this is a preview okay and I want to increase this passes as 4 or 5 now see the result And 
नेक्स्ट वी हैव ज्योमेट्री ज्योमेट्री वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिफाइंड टू लेक्सेस ऑब्वियसली जेड और बिकॉज वी हैव एंड सेलेक्ट एनी फर्स्ट फेस डेट्स वाई इट इज जेड ओके एंड द फीड एंड स्पीड सो लेट चेंज इट स्पीड एंड स्पीड सपोज दिस कटिंग फीड and the spindle speed oh, sorry here we have to click okay and cut region sequencing strategy under strategy okay this one see generate it is using this optimizing sequencing we have two reason one and two first it is cutting cutting the first one then it will move to the other one okay no need and for collision check tool and holder collision if it is colliding with the body generate and click okay now i want to generate the program of this one so right click over here and here we have the post process and i'm going to use mill 3 access okay and the unit as we have used in project the same unit will it will follow two number is missing so this is the program T zero zero because two number is not mentioned. Okay, so this is a program. Close. So this green right tick will come if you generate the program for this. Okay, then only it will come. And if you want to see the timing, so under this column we have total time, or here we have the time. See this time, sixteen minute it will take, twelve minute for cutting and three minute for non-cutting. Okay, 